So we've all been waiting for Melissa McCarthy's The Boss. So she stars as Michelle, who is an extraordinarily wealthy woman, and she's kind of like a motivational speaker. She then gets busted for insider trading and has to go to jail for a couple of months. Anyway, upon her release, she realizes that all her assets have been frozen. Speaking of frozen, Kristen Bell plays her poor, tired assistant, and Michelle comes to sleep on her poor, tired assistant's couch. There are genuinely funny moments in this film. One example is when Melissa McCarthy's character dresses her assistant for a date. It's pretty funny, there are lots of giggles on that. The rest of the gags in the film bring nothing new. It's been done time and time again and it's 2016 people, get some new jokes. Peter Dinklage is in this movie and he is terrible. He's so bad, he's so cringe and his acting is Horrific. He's a typical villain and he's the worst part of this movie. There I said it. Now the question is, should you see this movie? Well, there's a difference between seeing the movie and paying for the movie. Should you pay for the movie? Hell no! Should you see the movie? Yeah. Yeah, you should see the movie. You should see the movie in six months time when your friend asks you to come over and chill. If I still haven't convinced you and you're still going to see this movie, let me just bring some other statistics into the play. It got 33% rotten on Rotten Tomatoes and it got 4.1 out of 10 on IMDb. Those are some pretty crappy reviews, people. Let's just hope that Melissa McCarthy makes a special appearance on the Gilmore Girls reboot and then all will be right with the world again. Thanks so much for watching guys, don't forget to like, comment and share and please subscribe to EMGN's YouTube channel.